and welcome to my channel. It is Friday the 15th of February which means it's Way Day. I um, hope you've all had a fab week. How has my week been? Um, well I did mention a lot about um, the different kind of meals I've had in Chit Chat Thursday so if you wanted to watch that that's the video before this. Um, but yeah I've had a really good week on plan like I have food optimised as much as I could. Um, I've had some great meals. Um, I've my plate has been full, packed full of speed more than normal. Yeah, a really good week. I have been the higher end of my sins, which I don't know if that makes a difference, but it has been the higher end for me. Um, I have noticed though, and I did mention this on my Instagram, that on Thursdays I kind of take my foot off the gas a bit and. I relax a little bit more because even though I've got way in the next day which has only been the last three weeks I've done that and I really noticed it yesterday I was picking a lot more um, they've all been within my sins I think last week was maybe like a couple of sins over but I did tend to leave my sins lower on a Thursday and I'm talking low I'm talking about 10 which is quite low for me um, but otherwise been food optimising within my sins um, which is exactly what I did yesterday so yesterday even though I was picking I was at the higher end and I ended on 15 sins um, and then come the evening I had I didn't have anything to eat in the evening actually I don't think no I literally had well, apart from my dinner um, it ended up being a later dinner than planned um, I just had a cup of tea and things like that um, so I've had a really really good week on plan I was really hoping to lose a pound, um, but I'd also done exercise as well. So I know that sometimes can play up a little bit. Um, I've been doing, I would do three times a week this week, but I did push myself with weights. I upped my weights. So that can make a big impact for me. Um, so how was group today? Well, I've got an inset day today, so I will be keeping this quick because me and little Sydney have got a date to the cinema. Um, so yeah. He's downstairs, he's just on uh, watching a bit of TV while I get this recorded, but he came to group with me while I helped out and he was just on the iPad there. So um, yeah, it was really busy group, lots of some new faces as well. So let's just get on with it, shall we? <laughs> so last this week I got my new book, which is from the 12 week countdown, which is free food on the go some really good recipes in here actually if you haven't signed up to the 12 week countdown and you want to do it i definitely recommend it there's just some really i think with summer coming up um spring coming up there's gonna be more days out there's some really good recipes to take with you um like these for example veggie pakoras they look really nice and look very simple to make um also egg and pork pies i know we know how to make pork pies but these look really good um yeah just some lovely recipes so i would definitely be sitting down later on and having a look at that and writing some recipes down so how did i get on with the scales so i stepped on the scales and i put on a pound and a half i was gutted in fact i stepped on the scales and i put on two pounds and i was just like Okay, I knew what it was. I knew it was the exercise. That's the only thing I can put it down to because I was on it. But because this has happened to me before, I'm fine with it. But I thought, I need a wee. So I had a wee and I only put on a pound and a half. So I thought, I'm taking that. I'm not gonna chance anything else. I'm not gonna even try and have another wee or anything. I'm taking that. Um, so yes, I was a bit gutted, but that is the only thing I can think of. Um, it has happened before. Mm, I can't even tell you if it's been as drastic as that. But it's fine. It will come off next week. I know because I've pushed myself my weights, that's where I think the it has lied. So I think that's the only thing I can think of that my body... Um, so when you, when you build muscle the fat cells go and it replaces with water because it thinks the fat cells are going to build back up again so it kind of if that makes sense and then it realizes oh the fat's not coming back so whoosh the water goes um 
so that's the only thing I can think of and I know that is probably what it is and I will get a loss next week if I stick to plan which I plan to do um, exactly as I've done this week the only difference is next Thursday I'm going to keep my sins lower um, I'm going to carry on eating lots of free food I'm not going to go I have been really high on my sins like between sort of 10 and 15 but more nearer the 15 most days which maybe that is an issue for me or do I need to look at my portions? I'm very good with my pasta and rice. I do weigh that out because um, I just like to keep an eye on things. But to be honest with you, even when I like guess, I only have like a small portion compared to Darren. Um, but maybe, I don't know, maybe that's what I need to do. Or maybe just carry on doing what I'm doing and see if it is the exercise. Um, I've got a session on Sunday with boot camp. I've got a session on Wednesday. That's the only exercise boot camp wise I will be doing and I think I will do a workout as well um sorry I'm just gonna have some tea I will do a workout at home but we are doing lots of walking we've got some days out and things like that planned so yes I am a little bit gutted but I know what it is it's fine so there you can see I did fill out two pounds but because it changed to two and a half, one and a half she kind of had to adapt it so it's one and a half I put on making me 10 stone 11 and a half she's put 10 stone 12 because she hasn't changed it but it's 10 stone 11 and a half so yeah i'm just going to carry on doing what i'm doing i'm not i'm not worried about it it's fine if it'd been the 10 stone 12 i would have been a bit gutted to leave my book as that but because i haven't been that for a long time but i hopefully it'll come off next week However, on a non-scale victory, and I'm not going to show you now, because one, because I'm sitting down, but I can see my muscles in my stomach, like my temporary six pack. So first thing in the morning, I can see it. Um, and it's quite nice. I mean, I don't really want a six pack, but it's quite nice that I'm starting to see muscles come back as well, because before Christmas or week, more so November time, I was starting to have them. Whereas they kind of just have disappeared because I've done less exercise. So I think three times a week boot camp really suits me. Um, but so I'm starting to see that. I've also seen, which I hadn't seen before, definition in my back. So again, not too muscly, but more toned up. So because I'm seeing that, the number on the scales is, I'm not worried about that. So it's fine. Anyway, I have to go because we are going off going to see um, how to train a dragon um, managed to use I didn't realize you could use Tesco's vouchers for the cinema or well, the cinema that we is on one of our nearest not the one in our town but the next town along so yeah we're going to go in and see that um, just me and Sydney um, I think I could have the tango blast I think that's quite low sin so I think I might have that because I don't normally treat myself and because we've got the tickets free I thought well he can get some popcorn or um whatever a drink or whatever and I might get one of those tango blasts that everyone goes on about I think it's the sugar-free ones so have a fabulous weekend good luck to anyone who is weighing in um like today or um over the weekend and I shall catch up with you all very soon I will be do, doing a what I eat in a day either Sunday or Monday but I will definitely be doing some because I haven't done one since I've been doing sugar-free um but yeah I will keep you posted and get one of those out to you um thank you for watching everyone take care have a fabulous weekend and I'll speak to you soon bye